Inside the Stanford lab, a tiny cube lies waiting. It doesn't look like much, but it's actually a robot named Hedgehog. And it's out to prove the world's toughest questions can be answered by thinking inside the box. There's been an increasing interest in the scientific community to explore asteroids and comets. These are ancient bodies that have been relatively preserved since the formation of the solar system. Getting down close to the soil and taking samples and taking measurements will really help to answer the question, how did the solar system form? And Hedgehog is one mobility platform that should help answer that question. So this is our Hedgehog rover. It's a rover designed to hop on asteroids and comets. Now these are environments with extremely reduced gravity. So that requires a whole different approach for mobility. So instead of wheels like the Mars rovers have, we actually use internal flywheels to hop. So you see there's one, two, three internal wheels. Now the basic principle is we spin the flywheels up very slowly as to build momentum. So once enough energy has been built up in the system, we apply a mechanical brake and that causes it to very aggressively hop. Typical rovers use wheels to explore large bodies like planets. But on asteroids, the gravity can be 10,000 times lower, which means that same rover might weigh as much as a tennis ball. Not great for gaining traction, and a small bump could easily flip it upside down. Rest in peace, rover. The reason we have three flywheels is so that we can hop in any direction. So you can think of it like there's no right way up. There's no upside down for this thing. We can even spin. So I'll show you the spinning maneuver. And now when the top flywheel spins and I apply a brake, you can see we call that a spin or a yaw maneuver. And that could be useful if, for example, you wanted to point cameras or direct your scientific instruments or even just change orientation to take another hop. So as impressive as this looks on Earth, it would look even more impressive on an asteroid where gravity is so low that that amount of energy could cause it to hop tens or hundreds of meters. 